Hello my lovely angels, how are you guys doing? I hope you are fine and rocking as always. Today we are going to see how your coming week is going to be. So we have three options over here. Option number one is this beautiful page of pentacles card. Option number two is this page of wands card. And option number three is this lovely page of cups card. So you can select any option that you are drawn towards. In case if you are confused as to which option you should select, you can also take three pieces of paper. In each piece of paper, write one, two and three. Pile one, pile two and pile three. Say, dear God, God, Archangels, which pile is applicable to me? Pick up any one piece of paper, whatever number comes, that's going to be a pile. Another way is via date of birth. So I'm going to allocate date of birth uh, to the three piles and let's see. So while doing this, I'm not looking at the cards. Pile one. Pile two and three. Oh, look at that. They have come in a sequence. So if your date of birth is between, is from one to ten, that is this particular date of birth, you are eligible for pile 1. If your date of birth is 11 to 20, from 11 to 20 any of these then pile number 2 is applicable. If your date of birth is from 21 to 31 then pile 3 is applicable. So you can either choose by the pile or by uh, the chit system or by your date of birth whatever is comfortable. All right. So do subscribe to my channel if you're not already because I do come up with impromptu readings wherein I do readings weekly or once in 15 days or maybe once in a month as and when I get time in which I pick up a topic and I do live readings. So in order that you don't miss it, ensure that you are subscribing to my channel and clicking on the bell icon so that you're notified whenever I am online. All right, so let's get started. Hello group one, how are you guys doing? I hope you're fine and rocking as always. If you've chosen this pile because of this card or because of uh, your date of birth or because maybe you know you had drawn a, 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 you know you had just had three pieces of paper and you had chosen this particular pile. So if any of it you have chosen or you just drawn to this particular pile, then let's get started. So you have chosen page of pentacles, which means this week learning and knowledge is going to be of importance. It is a good week to pay attention to your body as well. A lot of learning is going to happen. A lot of upgradation is going to happen as well. Now, let's see how your week is going to be. Beginning of the week, mid of the week, and end of the week. Let's see all the cards one by one. Beginning of the week, you have got the Eight of Cups, which means you are going to walk away from something which is not serving you. You are going to let go of some aspect of your life which is becoming a little difficult for you to handle. You will also visit a spiritual place. You will find yourself doing a lot of spiritual activities in the beginning of the week. The mid of the week, you have got the two of wands, which means you are going to plan and prioritize. You're going to be presented with a choice and you have to use your heart and brain to make this choice. This choice will have a long term effect on your life. So gather all the information, take expert help and then make this choice. Partnerships and collaboration will also be a focus. There will be an international connect happening as well. At the end of the week, you have got 10 of pentacles. So some of you may attend a family event. Some of you may even uh, do some planning, financial planning and investments for your family. With this card, I also feel there is going to be, some of you may receive cash or gifts from family. There could be talks about inheritance happening for some of you. Now let's see the other two cards which I have already removed. 
you have got support so whatever support you need in order to go ahead with regards to your life that is going to be presented to you in this week ahead keep this card here surrender your ego it will be a good idea if you are flexible and if you ask for help do not be like you know oh um, i'm not going to take help maybe god has chosen that particular individual to help you or that's how the divine wants to help you so be open to help as well and also be of service to others do not be like you know it's my way or the highway in the coming week now let's see what your wheel of fortune is going to tell us. Think about a question, group one, and let me spin the wheel for you. You have got yes. So whatever question you have asked, the answer is a yes. Group 1, I hope you enjoyed this reading. Uh, we do have a broadcast channel in which we share a lot of rituals, uh, videos and stuff like that. Every day we share how the day is going to be from Monday to Friday. I'm also there on Instagram. My book Prayer Magic Miracles has got released. It has got 82 powerful prayers. The book is available both on in a physical copy and also on Kindle. Uh, I have kept the prices pretty low so that everybody can avail the book and make and take benefit out of it. So all the details of all of this is given in the pinned comment. You can go through it. Alright, group one, take care. Do share this video with your friends and family whom you think will benefit from this reading. Take care. Bye-bye. Hello group 2, how are you guys doing? I hope you are fine and rocking as always. Today we are going to see how your coming week is going to be. So you have chosen either the card page of wands or you chosen this pile because of your date of birth or you have chosen this pile based on the pile uh, chit that you got. Whatever mode you have chosen for this pile it is completely okay. Now let's see wh what your cards are going to tell us about your week ahead so you have chosen page of wands which means the week ahead is going to be full of action adventure uh, you're going to take certain risks you would want to do things in a very different way you would want to explore the energy is going to be of exploration risk and adventure a young man is going to help you at the same time i feel with this card there is going to be an accomplishment that you're going to have it would be like a feather in your cap Let's see the beginning of the week. The mid of the week. And the end of the week. I feel like somebody has said something to you, uh, you know, and that has kind of affected you at a deep level. You're like, you know, how can this person speak to me like this? Or it keeps on playing in your mind on a repeat mode. So you need to kind of let go. Okay. Do they are speaking what is their nature? You got over here Queen of Swords. So the beginning of the week, you are going to be very practical. You're going to pay attention to details uh, you're going to be very sharp minded and you would be tempted to use sharp words with others and yourself do not do that be gentle with yourself and others paperwork formalities will be of focus you will be again uh, clearly communicating with everyone around you but do not use harsh words a very sharp woman is going to be of help to you Wow, the middle of the week you have got the seven of swords, which means you need to be very careful of your belongings. You need to be vigilant. Someone may try to cheat you. Do not fall into that trap. Also, be very honest in your dealings. So you have got two sword cards till now, which means the week is going to be quite practical. All right. You have got the chariot. So you're going to move ahead during the weekend and not look back i also feel with this card you are going to focus on travel or you're going to make travel plans you're also going to move ahead uh, some of you may be servicing your vehicles as well now let's see what your oracle cards are going to tell us 
you have got infinite abundance cards a lot of money coming to you and this or you're going to get ideas to have more money coming to you uh, so you will be working on those ideas as well i also feel there is going to be a lot of abundance and uh, some sort of event you may be attending is what i am getting also some somebody may be eyeing your money okay so be careful surrender to miracles so this week expect that miracles can happen to them and when we say surrender to miracles it means that somewhere you need to believe that miracles can happen to you you cannot be always like you know what uh, i always have to work hard to get what i want miracles can never happen to me that's not the idea that you should have because whatever you believe it multiplies in your life whether you want it or whether you do not want it all right so believe in miracles and you will expect more of it in your life especially at the weekend okay now let's see what your uh, wheel of fortune is going to tell us so think about a question group two and let me spin the wheel for you Wow, it went, went to miracle and then it came to wait. And uh, I feel the wait is because somewhere you need to believe that miracles can happen to you. Somewhere you have kind of conditioned yourself to believe that, you know what, I have to have everything the hard way. All right, group two, I hope you enjoyed this reading as much as I did. If you did, do hit the like button to subscribe to my channel if you are guided. And yes, I am there on WhatsApp uh, wherein my... Uh, my team has a broadcast list where we share every day from Monday to Fire Friday how your day is going to be. We share various rituals depending upon the day. Like today we have shared, uh, for today we have shared the, Lak the Lakshmi Panchumi ritual yesterday so that you, you are ready with whatever you need to do. And we keep on sharing a lot of stuff on that broadcast. You can be a part of that broadcast list. Uh, also my book Prayer, Magic and Miracles is out both on Kindle and on um, as a physical copy as well. You can avail uh, the links in the pinned comment. All right, take care of yourself. Bye bye. Lots of love to you. Hello, Group Three. How are you guys doing? I hope you're fine and rocking as always. If you have chosen this pile because of this card, or because of the date of birth that you you fall into, or you have chosen this card because this pile because you just felt like choosing it, all right, whatever it is, this is for you. So your chosen page of cups, which means this week there is going to be emotional new beginning. There is going to be a good news coming your way. A young person is going to be of importance and this young person is going to help you and guide you and bring that playfulness in your life again. The beginning of the week. mid of the week you become so serious you are really not having fun with life anymore end of the week the beginning of the week you have got the six of wands which means this week there is going to be success coming your way you are going to be victorious and you're going to win people are going to appreciate and applaud you at the same time ensure that you are not having too much of ego you're flexible the middle of the week you got queen of wands wow so you are going to have a glow up in the middle of the week you may go to a salon you may go to go for a spa or some treatment you may also go for shopping uh, and upgrade your wardrobe as well with this card i feel that somebody who is extremely confident is going to help you you got two wand cards which means a lot of action and adventure this week the end of the week you have got the ten of cups which means family is going to be a focus during the weekend you may attend a family event you may spend time with your family uh, also some of you who are planning for a family may take steps ahead during the weekend all right now let's see the other two cards you have got options. So this uh, this week, you're going to explore options with regards to your life purpose. Whether you're a homemaker, a type person, student, 
or a corporate career or a business person you are going to explore the various options that are available to you you need to surrender to wonder and awe you have become so practical in life that you cannot look beyond practicality however you need to have that element of wonder and awe which we had when we were a kid or right wherein we would look at small small things and be so happy now we just pray for big things and forget the magic that small small blessings bring in our life so that's that's something you need to correct now let's see what your wheel of fortune is going to tell us group three so think about a question and let me spin the wheel for you you have got trust so trust that things are going to be okay with you and you're going to do magic all right group three so i have a broadcast channel on whatsapp on telegram wherein we share uh, rituals for example today's lakshmi panchami so we had shared a ritual for the same yesterday also we share from monday to friday how your day is going to be do subscribe to this channel and press the bell icon because i do live readings as well so you will get notified when that happens my book prayer magic and miracles is available it's 82 prayers for all parts of life and um, it is available on kindle and on amazon i kept the prices pretty very very low so that everybody can benefit from the book all right uh, group three i hope you enjoyed this reading as much as i did if you did do hit the like button to subscribe to my channel and lots of love to you Bye bye